Last night, the Nuggets, I mean, wow, over the Lakers. 112 to, what was it, 112 to 105, I think. Here's Michael Malone. Well, I would say um, there, there's a, a confidence that comes with being a champion. You know, there, there, there's a confidence with that starting five, Christian Brown, who played last year. And as much as, you know, you miss guys like Jeff Green and Bruce Brown and Ish Smith, uh, we have confidence in Christian and Peyton and, uh, and Reggie Jackson. But that starting group, man, they've, uh, they've been through a lot of wars, and they're battle-tested. And every time we get down, we don't panic. We stay the course, and we find a way to get back in the game. And the crazy thing is it's another game. We were spotted a 12-point lead, and we come back and win. And um, you know, I hope that's not going to be the same uh, come Saturday in game four. But um, bringing a, winning a championship has, has brought that group tremendous confidence, not only in themselves, but in the collective. You, you just mentioned Reggie. Pretty serious. Looked like ankle sprain when he came. We got some Reggie question here in a second from um, Scott. 112 to 105, you had four starters with 20 points or more. And Aaron Gordon had the playoff game of his freaking life. 29 points, 12 of 18, 5 of 6 from the free throw line. 10 or 15 rebounds. He was a giant. Michael Porter Jr., 20 points, 10 rebounds. Nikola Jokic, a Sambord double, 24, 15, and 9. Jamal Murray on 8 of 21 shooting, <laughs> which percentage-wise I think is a little better than 9 of 24 in his first two games. Not a lot better, though. And only 1 for 6 from 3, 22 points. Listen, Jamal Murray made a shot. I mean, I I understand Jamal Murray made a shot, right, AD? Uh, Jamal Murray made a shot. I mean, I get it. But he hasn't played great. KCP, 2 of 7, 1 of 5 from 3, 5 points. I mean, not really much off the bench. But you've got four starters with 20-plus points. The Lakers, it's remarkable. 33 from AD, 26 from LeBron, 59 points. They've gotten 59 points, 58 points, 59 points. Those two are having a great series. They really are. You got to have more than just two dudes. Hachimura, five points. No points. You cannot have a game like this. D'Angelo Russell, 24 minutes, no points. 0 for 7 from the field, 0 for 6 from 3. That is horrific. And he was 7 for 11 for 3 in game 2. That is so bad. Austin Reeves with 22 points was okay. He was okay. But you got to be kidding me. They don't have a team. And everybody's yelling about Darvin Ham. What's Ham supposed to do? I don't care. It's Lakers. You want to fire Darvin Ham, fire Dar- Darvin Ham. But they just, they just don't have a team. They don't. Uh, here is um, Mike Malone. Reggie Jackson looked like he turned his ankle pretty bad here. Um, you won't know. You got 48 hours before you got to play again. But will you guys get together and say, okay, if, if he can't, we're going to do X, Y, Z, or we're going to try A, B, C. Will that happen over the next few hours? Probably both A, B, C, and X, Y, Z. <laughs> I don't know if you want to throw any more letters in there in that alphabet. <laughs> but um, no, The funny thing is, Scott, there was a chance that Reggie didn't even play tonight. He was sick, you know, uh, was not feeling very well. So we kind of had that conversation uh, this afternoon going into the game. If Reggie's unable to go, what can we look to do? And uh, now the same thing's going to happen. We'll see how his ankle responds to treatment in the next 48 hours. And, uh, you know, if, if he's not able to go, obviously we'll have to find somebody to go out there and uh, spell Jamal. And we've used Christian Brown before. And uh, we've played with Nicola and Aaron being a kind of point center and point forward. So we'll have, uh, we'll have uh, ample options if Reggie's not able to go. But hopefully he can. You know, he's an important part. Okay. Yeah, he is an important part. And I'm not trying to discount Reggie Jackson. 
But Christian Brown has stepped up. Had a good game last night. You got Holiday. Aaron Gordon can play the point center. So could Jokic. They're all right. They're fine. And I hope Reggie just gets better. But Reggie only played seven minutes last night. So I, I, I don't want anybody to be hurt. I hope Reggie gets better. But you got to realize something. Teams that are in the NBA up 3-0 are 151-0 and zero in the series. Are you ready for that? Teams up 3-0. Statistically, right now in the NBA, have won the series every time. Jokic was asked about the season in general. Uh, the defending champ, a lot of times, the regular season can just feel like waiting to get to this part again. Now that you're actually here and starting to rack up what you'll need of 16 wins, what does that feel like and how is that different after you've been spending, you know, six to seven months just kind of waiting for this moment again? I mean, to be honest, I think that that doesn't, that, that thing doesn't exist. We can just like flip, flip the switch and then like play a playoff game. I think you need to build it and we needed to build it because we don't have the same team and uh, the guys work. Um, okay, we have the, like the first, you know, first five is, is basically the same and the, the next guys are completely different. They're playing different roles. They're playing different minutes so we need a time to, to to learn how to play together and I think we did a good job I think we are ready um, yes we are up 3-0 uh, against, against them and uh, I think like the nice like tonight uh, just show us that everybody is capable of, doing, of having uh, big nights yeah it's it's a family they're together they are an unstoppable force they are your Denver Nuggets likely the series will finish on Saturday in Los Angeles. Maybe L.A. gets a win. You'd be putting off the inevitable. I mean, do whatever you need to do in that one. You need to rest, guys. You need to, I mean, seriously, who cares? <laughs> it won't bother me at all if they don't sweep the Lakers. It'll be fun to have the Nuggets finish off the Lakers at home. But I don't know how much heart the Lakers are going to have. It's fantastic. I have I have no idea if LeBron is blaming the replay center today. Uh, in the NBA last night, um, the Magic, oh my God, 39 po 38 points. They beat um, the Cavaliers 121 to 83. Like, how does that happen? How do two teams, I don't even know how that happens, but wow. Uh, Cleveland leads the series two to one. Sixers got over on the Knicks. Little revenge for the Sixers. All right. 125 to 114. Um, in the NBA tonight, you got Bucks, Pacers, Clippers at the Mavericks, Timberwolves at the Suns. We'll see if the Suns can offer up any resistance. Come on, Suns. Do something for us, will you? We'll have um, coverage of the Nuggets on Saturday from Ball Arena. We'll go live again before the game uh, right here on Kill You With Truth. Extensive post game afterwards, during the game, just everything. We got you, baby. We got you. We are all in for these playoffs. So just keep it here with Kill You With Truth. Um,